Hi everyone, today is Motivational Thursday and today subject, let's say harvest. I am out this morning harvesting my vegetables and these are the little small vegetables, uh, tomatoes. Now this year I sowed three types of tomatoes in my garden and the small ones are ready to harvest. But what I really want to bring forth today is I had squirrels that sowed a seed in my yard, a peach seed. And now I have a full grown peach tree. Not exactly sure when they sowed the seed, but they did. And now it's growing and it's bearing fruit. It's about 30 peaches that's on this tree. What's interesting this morning, I thought about um, people can do that to you too. Your environment can do that too. They can sow seeds in your life and over time it can start bearing fruit. This is where we uh, begin to have the scenario of life that totally goes against the word of God. You know, the goodness, the peace, the love, it will go against that. Now, if you're having this harvest and these things are going against the goodness of, of grace and goodness of love, then perhaps there was seed sown in your life and this now bearing that fruit. What do you do about a full grown tree that's bearing fruit that you're not agreeing with? You go out and you dig up that tree, you dig up the root and you uproot all the things that you're not liking. So you see this? Three types of different tomatoes and a peach tree. What if those trees was weeds? I would go out and I would uproot the weeds. That's what you have to do with your life. Everything that you're bearing that you're not agreeing with, uproot it. Because it may not have been sown by you. It could have been sown by somebody else. You don't have to agree with it. Now, I would not <laughs> plant a tree, a fruit tree, that bears fruit that I don't like. I'm not going to eat it. I'm not going to take care of it. And that's what you have to do in your life. If you bear a fruit that you're not agreeing with, you're not required to receive that type of harvest. So today, uproot the things that you don't like and keep the things that you do. Bye, you guys.